I'm Allie. I've had my own successful design business here in Calgary for the past 15 years. And I'm Jason, a marketing and communications consultant, also in Calgary. We just bought our dream house, a 1960s bungalow that we're renovating from top to bottom and bringing into the future. But not without breaking a few classic design rules along the way. With a little peace, love and patience, we're confident we're gonna get this home done on time. Maybe a lot of patience. Maybe a lot of time. Welcome to Jason and Allie's House Rules. So the purchase of our house was brought on by one question. Should we renovate our bathroom? And so I asked Jason, because we had lived in our old house for the past 13 years, and I thought maybe our bathroom needed a little bit of a revamp. But I said, Ali, why are we redoing a bathroom that was redone 10 years ago? If you really need a project, maybe we need to buy something else. And I said, okay, let's do this. So we started looking in the spring this year and it was pretty clear that whatever we were gonna to decide to do, we were gonna to have to move fast because the market was hot. Looked at it, what, like on a on Friday? A Friday. <laughs> Friday morning, Jason sent me the link and I was like, okay. Talked to our real estate agent, we went and saw the house, took our contractor through on the Saturday, decided what we were gonna do on the Sunday, put in an offer that evening and by Monday, we had the house and then, I panicked because I was like, what have we done? <laughs> when we first saw this house, I was automatically in love. Like it was charming. It had all of those really incredible moments that I love so much. There was brick and I definitely saw all the potential. Yeah, it had the right amount of square footage. It was a bungalow and it had a few of those little things that were must haves for us, like a wood burning fireplace. For some reason that was number one on our list. Always number one. A wood burning fireplace is something that I will never be able to live without. But there was also lots of opportunity that we saw with the interior of the house as well. Turning you know, the garage into more living space and maybe a studio area for us. Adding in a secondary garage into the back. And I feel like that's something that we lucked out on is because we can definitely see that potential in in an older home and see what we can you know do with it rather than seeing for what it was then i think ali put all of his staff and said okay all hands on deck we need to lay out this house immediately well of course this looks really great but let's put plan on paper and actually see if we can get a master bedroom upstairs if we can get an ensuite if we can get all the elements that we wanted to and again, lucky enough, I have my own design firm, so we really got to do that fairly quickly. And it worked out for us, and now it's, now it's go time. 